Kristen Drysdale says, do you see Evernote ever getting into providing their own browsers? Why or why not? Do you use it? They better not. Because the last thing they want to compete with is Google. Um, nobody should be trying to compete with Google right now. Everybody should be trying to jump on the Google bandwagon because you might as well, I, unless you're as big as Microsoft and you can create a good product, don't even bother competing with Google. <coughs> Excuse me. Google is too good at what they do. Too good at what they do. And then by the time you did compete with them and you became better than them, they'd come in there with a huge check and you couldn't say no. <laughs> they buy it off of you. Uh, I don't see Evernote ever creating a web browser. I think it would be a bad idea. Evernote does what it does very well. Evernote, for those of you who do not know what Evernote is, is a note-taking application that is cross-platform. There are Evernote plugins for Google Plus or extensions. There's Evernote apps, um, and it's a great way. Uh, there's an Evernote desktop app for your computer. It is a great way to manage to-do lists, uh, projects, any kind of organizational thing you might need to do. Uh, completely free. Uh, you sign up for your own account. I think the only thing they may charge you for is if you decide you want to expand your storage of how many notes you want to keep stored on there. And it's a great, great service, Kristen. It is. Uh, if they ever made their own uh, actual browser, I, it would fail horribly. Um, and, and pretty much everybody is being brute forced out of the browser market. Even Mozilla is kind of struggling right now. Because everybody's going Chrome and everybody's going, uh, actually, you no, know, Mozilla, Firefox, and Chrome are the two big players. Uh, and Internet Explorer is still hanging in there, but it's only a matter of time before, once Windows dies off or fades, doesn't die off. Once Windows becomes more obscure and a less prominent player in the operating system market, which I hate to say it, but given the current trend, that's what's ha where it's going, Internet Explorer is also going to drop like a rock off of the the actual browser market competition. So, 